I got a lot of new fragrances in, big box, big jumbo size box. And these are fragrances that I have been putting off for so long, putting them off, putting them off, putting, that's a knife. And I finally got the opportunity to just pick them all up. Do this. So quite a few that I really wanted to pick up here. Um, they, they were on my wish list for a very long time and I'm, they're finally in my grasp. I ordered this from Fragrance Net. Fragrance Net does like uh, discounted fragrances. So if you're interested in any kind of fragrances, go check out their prices. And uh, they most likely have some of the best. I'm not paid by them, but Fragrance Net, if you wanna pay me, paper. Oh yeah. Oh, this one's dinged up. <sighs> yeah. And I have bad luck. So the first one I picked up was Bentley. For men absolute look at this you can actually see the uh indentation very sad that hopefully the juice is not messed up in here quite disappointing but you know bentley for men absolute mercedes-benz club black oh i'm so uh, it was upside down so looking forward to this one this one is totally blind but this is jet black reserve and it's an eau de parfum and it's a 3.4 ounce i have never I saw this one. I was very, very intrigued. I think Gensense has a um, collaboration with them. I'm pretty sure. And then the next one was Chrome Extreme by Azaro. I've wanted this one ever since it was released or announced. This one gets compared to Aqua di Gio Profondo. It's still summer kind of time-ish, so I can still wear this a little bit. Um, but from what I hear, I can wear this in the fall time too. So I'm excited for this one, definitely. And the last one I am so excited for. Ralph's Club by Ralph Lauren. And this is the Eau de Parfum. So the Parfum was just released and I was holding off buying the Eau de Parfum until I saw reviews for the Parfum. From what all these reviewers have said about it, it's very close to the skin and I'm kind of looking for something more versatile that I can spray on every day I work like a lot so I need like just fragrances that I can throw on real quick and run out the door um, so and then of course exceptional because you are that goes back in the box you know I love ordering from fragrance net but I always get like juped on the shipping their free shipping option it, it it always takes them like seven to eight days to deliver i ordered this three weeks ago this didn't come in till the next three weeks and it's tuesday on the next three weeks so it's like um i've been waiting and waiting and waiting for this i love fragrance net they have great prices but quite frustrating sometimes all right here we go this is bentley it sucks, I have like really bad luck when it comes to bottles. Ooh, whoa. <laughs> oh shit. The cap is nice, the cap is nice. It doesn't stick, it stick on there really good. All right, here we go. Bentley, absolutely. I've heard a lot of good things about this one. I haven't looked at any notes too, so I'm just going kind of blind here on this. Mm, it's very dark. Well, it's very uh, dark, woody, smoky, like earthy. It smells great. The There's such high quality in here, but putting me off a little bit. Um, it's good, but I'm gonna have to like really spend some time with this. Um, it's good though. I love the black bottle. It's really nice. This is definitely a wintertime fragrance, but I like it. I definitely like it. Next one up is Ralph's Club Eau de Parfum. I wanted to pick up the Parfum. I think I will if I like this one, but um, I wasn't sure. And a lot of a lot of the people that I really look up to in the fragrance community said um, that it's a little weaker, and so I decided to skip that one for now. Ooh. Wow. Oh my God. Oh, that's like perfect. That's perfect versatility right there. That's exactly what I like right there. Oh, it's soapy and clean and it's woody and gotta be some like spot, like a cardamom maybe. Oh, it's nice. Oh gosh. You can definitely smell like some bubble gum kind of sweetness. Oh, it's so fresh. Oh man, that's really good. Ralph's Club. Um, 
I'm gonna be taking that for a drive. So I wanted to pick this one up for a while. I put it off, put it off, I put it off, decided to pull the trigger. And the cap is actually, hear that? Chrome Extreme, let's give it a good old spray on. I'm not too familiar with the Chrome line, so I can't tell you if this is extreme, because I don't know what extreme means for Chrome. I have never smelled the original Chrome, so bear with me. That atomizer is so good. Ah, oh, alcohol. Give it a minute. Oh, very nice. Yeah, just needed a minute. Oh yeah, sharp, citrusy, sexy. This is good. This is, this is some good ass shit. Oh, it's very nice. It's very nice. It, it has that like aqua di Gio profondo kind of take. I like it. I like it a lot. I should have bought this sooner in the, um, the summertime, but it'll work now. I don't know what to expect with this one. This is a complete blind buy. I, I didn't watch any fragrance reviewers on this. I didn't go to Fragrantica at all. I looked at it. There was a lot of great reviews in the fragrance net comment section. I was making an order. Let's do it. This is something that I don't know anything about. That is called presentation, Armani. They've got their presentation like a game. All right, here we go. Now just, ooh, the bottle is like heavy. It's got a nice M at the top there. The cap, it like fits snug into place. It's not a click on, but it's snug. This is like really subtle scent. It's really subtle. I don't know. I, I it, I'm kind of taken back by it. It's very subtle. It's it's not something that's um, blasting off my skin here. I didn't look at any notes, so I'm assuming there's a lot of woods in here. Man, it, it's just, it's sexy. It, it's its very subtle, very sexy, very just alluring, I think. Um, the pressurized atomizer just gets it a 10 out of 10. Um, I'm not really sure. This is interesting. It's very, very subtle. I might be nose blind because I just sprayed on like 75 colognes, but uh, from what I'm just picking up, it's very nice, very, very nice. So, so star of the show here, Mercedes-Benz Club Black. I am so looking forward to this one. Let's see if I get juped on the bottle again this time. Ooh, no, actually it's good. That is sexy, wow. Atomizer's good. It's like the one million, the black version of the one million. It's good. Have you been my whole life? Oh my God, yes. It's like, it, it's vanilla, obviously, but very spicy, very, it's like almost dry. It almost smells like a sexy vanilla cigarette. The vibes I'm picking up. Sexy night out in a jazz club. Oh man. This is too good. I have, I've just, this is my first impression and I'm blown away with this. This is so delicious. Very good, very good. So far, these are all very good. Oh, and it stands up. The base is flat here, so it actually stands up. If you guys like this video, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe if you wanna see more fragrance-related content Monday and Friday. I wanna say thank you to everyone who has subscribed um, lately. I'm just, I'm excited about the growth of the channel and I am just ecstatic about it. I've got new videos just coming your way. So take care and see you next time.